Hey guys, it's Jazzbridge92, and today I'm just going to show you guys some of my nail polishes that I have. Um, I have quite a few, so I'm going to do this in like three-parter, four-parter, um, depending how long each video is going to be. Um, and I'm going to start the clock for the whatever. Um, this is going to be the part one, and then part two, and part three, and then, you know, whatever. Um, so, first few the first one, the first part for for this nail polish collection is gonna be um, just random like miscellaneous products. Where I'm just like, right, don't know, remember, yeah. Like I'm just gonna, I don't even remember when I bought them, and they don't really fit into any other of my other brands, so I'm just gonna do them separately. Um, some of the um, stuff that I got are from department stores, like from MAC, um, to the drugstore, to like, like, you know, just like a regular shopping mall, or whatever, like, you, you, you can get your hands on to, um, even to Sephora, um, and the first, this, these are like, like, you know, the small little, um, uh, little ones where you get, like, for, like, rhinestones, or they're just like a, bigger, like, the smaller sample of, like, the bigger one. So, um, this was from the Halloween collection, and this is the Wet n' Wild Fantasy Maker Glow in the Dark, uh, thing, and this is how, what it looks like, and this one is in, um, uh, in glow, and I don't really use this just because it's not, like, the greatest nail polish ever because it makes your nails have a tint of yellow and which is not great for anybody so that was not a good thing um these two are for from rhinestone one's from sensational and this is one's from Nailene and this is Nailene this is sensational and they're both top coats um speaking of top coats I have two such feet nail um uh, nail polish um dry fash top coats and they were like um Eight ninety nine seven ninety nine each for like where I bought them. So uh, this um, so this was like buy one get one half off. So I just bought two of them. Uh, and then some nail art brushes. Um, this is from Kiss and um, this is number. This is in white and it looks like that. Um, this is how the packaging looks like. Looks like this. Um, it comes in a whole lot of different colors. It has stencils with it, so um, if you're not really good at nail polish art, you can always use a stencil and you know just go from there. Um, and then this is from Art Club, and this was uh, Grape Escape, and this is just the purple nail art um, brush polish. Um, the NYC um, long wearing nail enamel in snow white. Um, hey guys, um, I'm really sorry that the camera cut me off, um, it was dying, I didn't know, um, but, um, I was talking about the NYC nail polish, and the, this nail polish was, um, I got this at the CNE, and I put, like, what the CNE is around, like, either, um, as an annotation or into the sidebar, so check wherever I put them, um, so I got this for like two dollars. It was like five, six for two dollars. So it's just like, eh, whatever, right? So, um, the next few products are this one is from Revlon, and this is um, the uh, I think the breast cancer one where every um, every nail you know, polish bought uh, goes to the um, goes to the I think. Uh, breast Cancer Awareness uh, Foundations, and this one is in Pink Pursuit, and um, it's a very light pink, um, or a muted pink, with some um, shimmer, with like some gold shimmers in it, so that's pretty, um, and then um, my mom bought this um, like a long time ago, um, and she really haven't used it, I haven't really used it, but this one is from Billy Cosmetics, and this is called Bubblegum. Um, and the label came off, so yeah. Um, it's very light bubblegumish pink, um, and it's very frosty, so 
that was a dollar from like a dollar store or whatever. Um, and then I got this from the collection, um, the Hello Kitty collection from Mac. And you can buy this um, alone. You don't necessarily need to buy the one with Hello Kitty on it, but I just got this um, because I really like the Hello Kitty design on it. Um, and this one is in Fastra White, and it's a very, it's a cream color. So there you go. And then I got a Wet n Wild um, Neo Color in Craze. And uh, this one is in uh, gold mine, and this is from the Craze collection. As but I wanted to say was, um, and it's a very um, light gold with some like shimmer on it. So that's pretty. Um, and then this was from the Halloween collection from Wen Wild, um, and it's a fantasy maker, um, and it looks like this. And uh, it's a very, it's, this one is in black if I haven't mentioned that already, um, and yeah. So this is, I'm done with this um, part of the collection of the miscellaneous products and whatnot. So I'll be talking to you guys in part two.